All right, here we go. A temple on top of a mountain. What connection could a place like this have to the luminary? It's Certainly the monks. benefits from divine protection of some kind. Yggdrasil fell to earth not far from here, yet the temple buildings escaped entirely unscathed. The monks on the mountain. <gasps> I know that face. That man is a knight of Heliodor. It's a whole group of Krillins. <laughs> <laughs> Heliodorian swine! You think that your blockade will break us? Think again. The disciples of Angrilla are made of sterner stuff, as you will soon see. Well, welcome to the dab side, Chu. He says, I found out you were with Machinima. Did you ever meet guys who did RB in the team? Nope. I didn't meet anyone who worked for Machinima. I only met a few other partners like me who were just partnered with them, and that was short-lived, so... <clears throat> what in the... These movements must be intended to confound us. <laughs> be on your guard. They may attack from any angle. They're doing Tai Chi. Enough, all of you. Is this how we treat visitors? As your High Lama, I order you to stand down. So it's supposed to be like the Dalai Lama. So yeah, it's supposed to be like monks in the mountains. Your I Holiness, knew it. these people are not visitors. They are soldiers of Heliodor. We cannot be sure of their intentions. Oh, excuse me. Gigram Chiri says, I remember someone talking about a Dragon Ball Z RPG on the... One of the Dragon Quest events, but there was one on the SNES, but it was only in Japanese. Ah. Soldiers of Heliodor, you Didn't say? Didn't know that. The tall one, perhaps, but his young friend does not look like a military man to me. <gasps> I sense a great power within you. Tell me, young man, are you the luminary? Tell me, young man, are you five? <laughs> Have your balls Incredible. dropped yet? He divined your true identity with a single glance. How Plus his fucking we amazing armor. This day. He, he, he fucking struts up here in this insanely cool armor. <laughs> Please, you must forgive my disciples' discourtesy. Their training is... incomplete. Welcome to Anguilla, honored luminary. It would please me if you would join me in the high hall at the top of the temple. We have much to discuss. Oh boy, story elaboration. Let me guess, we're gonna go Strange to the summit child, and do a trial or something. But remarkably perceptive for one so young. There is more to him than meets the eye, that much is certain. Well, we have come this far. We might as well make our way to this high hall of theirs. See what he has to say. Right. New town, Angrila, not Shangrila, Angrila. Apparently, they're very angry here. You know that goddamn luminary? He's gonna save the world one day, but everywhere he goes, he just smashes everyone's fucking pots. He's a real dick that way. Keep his hands off. Get all this shit to loot. Don't go hungry. Angrilla's delicacies, yes. Girl about town, Puerto Valor. I'm not reading that. Probably like Paris Hilton's travel journals. Mini metal. That's why it's always worth it to check these areas out. You find a ton of mini metals. That's a save point. What's this? I don't know. I'm mashed. Only on that stairwell? No, this is the item shop. This is the inn. Is there anything in here? Not that I can see. Oh wait! Oh my God! A chest. Let's 
Ethereal Stone. There you go. WDZ, I'm playing Fist of the North Star tomorrow as my main gameplay stream, four plus hours. So, come on back tomorrow if that's what you're looking for. Get yeah, plenty of it. So we're going further up. Let me make sure I didn't miss anything. I'm trying to take every staircase, look for every item. Nope, that just loot. Okay. Here we are. Duh! He goes to someone needs to take the luminary. To, to task for all the things he broke, take on Judge I Judy. You once again to Angola, yes. honored luminary. As I believe you know, it is my privilege to serve as High Lama of this most sacred temple. Luminary, we appreciate that you were trying to save the world on multiple occasions and rid the world of many monsters, bosses, and all kinds of invasion, infection invasions from the evildoers, but why'd you have to break so many goddamn pots? I am to address you as your holiness, correct? Might I ask what you and your people know of my companion? Why everything, of course. We have awaited his coming ever since the day he entered this world, in the castle of Dundrasil. Waiting for him? What do you mean? I mean exactly what I say, nothing more. Tell me, do you recognize the symbol on this banner? It is the emblem of Dundrasil. Oh my god. Since the age of heroes, the princes of that nation have come here to train with us for six years of their youth. Your young friend was born a prince of Dundrasil. Thus do we expect him to come here as a boy and study under the great Grand Master Pan. And he never did. Sadly, <laughs> that was not to be. See you later, Derek. Have a good night. So if fate had been kinder, you would have spent a good part of your childhood here. What of his tutor, this Grand Master Pang you speak of? When the Lord of Shadows brought the World Tree low, the Master set out to summon a magical mandala to protect the temple from destruction. The spell succeeded, but its power was too great. Grand Master Pang did not return. That sucks. A noble sacrifice indeed. Now that the Master is gone, it falls to me to guide you. Come to the Field of Discipline. It lies behind this hall. There is something you must see. Alright, this is the next level of training. Sneaking Burrows in a hundred bit here. The master cannot be here. I would have liked to meet one so noble. Come, let us see what His Holiness has in store. Thank you, Stinkin' Burrows, for the hundred bit cheer. He says, hey there, buddy, what's up, Stinkin'? What's up, stinking? Anything up here? What the hell is this? Uh, the Grand Master's chamber, but the Grand Master's dead, so I guess he's not in here anymore. The Sutra of Angrela! I'm not reading that. I mean, I want crafting. Give me crafting recipes. Come on, right now. Fuck. On the nature of the naughty stick. Is that what I actually just said? On the nature of the naughty stick. Uh, magic water. Stole it right out of the fucking... The dead, the dead master's room. Oh, he's dead. He won't be fucking needed anymore. I'll take that shit. I'll make use of it. Alright, this way. To the field of discipline. As you all know, I'm one of the most disciplined individuals on the planet. It should go perfectly well. Beyond <laughs> those doors lies the field of discipline, where students of Angrila strive for enlightenment. Gigro Chiri says, remember that frozen dragon you saw on the lake by the frost witch crust? They mentioned in a book you read that someone someone placed it there because it was wrecking shit at that town. Oh yeah. Before huh. we tread upon this hallowed ground. Let me tell you a little of our history. 
and of the luminary of legend himself, Erdwin. Erdwin. Before setting out to defeat the Dark One, Erdwin came to our temple to learn from the Wise Ones, who made their homes here even then. He learned Kung Fu! The first Grand Master, Ai, accepted him as a disciple and trained him in the secrets of spiritual realization. But he did not train alone. During his time here, he met someone. Someone who would change his fate forever. The Shredder of Rukusaki. Who was this person? Another of Ai Yi's disciples. A young mage whose talent outshone that of all who had come before. A man named Morkant. Erdwin and Morkant would train together every day, each striving to outstrip the other. Though they were fierce rivals, they became firm friends. When their training was complete, Morkant joined with Erdwin in his quest to slay the Dark One. Ah, oh, he was one of the original Without 30. Without Morkant's magic, he might never have prevailed. Before setting out, they carved an inscription into this stone. A pledge of eternal friendship. Aww. It has been a treasure of ours ever since. Fred Flintstone cheers to yeet, and then S Dad 5000 cheers to join the stream. You turn down the music a bit. <coughs> it's kind of loud. Um, all right. There, I just lowered it a little bit. Maybe that'll be better. Morkum. I have not heard the name before. No, welcome to the dab side. I will not dab. Sorry. Now, allow me to show you to the field of discipline. If you would be so good as to follow me. Okay. No, I refuse to follow you. The game ends here. <laughs> With the Dragon Ball Welcome tournament will be held. Field of discipline. Since the age of heroes, many a would-be warrior has spilt sweat and blood upon these flagstones. If your karma had been different, this is where you would have trained under Grand Master Pang, like all the princes of Dundrasil before you. I have brought you here so that you might stand in the footsteps of your ancestors. An hmm. unbroken line leading all the way back to the age of heroes. Thanos Swing says, instead of that, can you do, do in-game music? I don't think so. I think we looked at it, and there's no way to just change the music. It was just a, a volume in general, if I remember correctly. I can look once I can control again. Even but... your grandfather, Lord Robert, completed his training here. The memory of his achievements shall live long in the temple's memory. His achievements? <laughs> Pang was a harsh master. With this implement, disciples whose efforts were lacking were given motivation. Directly to their fundament. It became known as... The Naughty Stick! Oh, During what the, the fuck? During the course of his six years of tuition, your grandfather's right honorable posterior was paddled an unprecedented 10,000 times. Oh. The tale of Lord Robert's road to enlightenment lives on to this day. Every disciple knows that he must focus at all times, lest he face the same fate. This is some S&M shit right now. <laughs> A legendary achievement indeed. You are worried for your grandfather, yes? Do not be. Lord Robert overcame every challenge set for him by the Grand Master, and emerged stronger every time. And his ass also swelled up a little bit more every time. The fall of the spank. world tree would not have been enough to extinguish one so resilient. He is alive. I sense it. Whoa, he thinks he's alive, huh, Rob? Tonight there will be a modest feast in the High Hall to celebrate your long-awaited arrival. We would be greatly honored if you would join us. We may not be able to aid you as we would have done were Master Pang still with us. But in this respect at least, we can provide. Alright, that night the High Lama holds a banquet in DSP's honor. The long-suffering disciples are overjoyed to have an evening respite from their training and eat, drink, and dance till the early hours. Then morning comes.
Then the morning comes. Do 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 do. Awake at last. Hmm? It is high time we were on our way. If the Grand Master was still alive, perhaps we might have learned something to help us in our fight against the Lord of Shadows. Sadly, it was not to be. Uh, Dick is back and he cheered. What's up, Dick? Okay, so where are we heading now? Outside the high hall. Okay. King Griff says, thank God there was no Puff Puff session with all males. And the hermit? Uh, what news of him? Forgive us, your holiness. The monsters on the mountain path were too strong. We were unable to reach him. I see. Your holiness, is there a problem? Yes, Sir Hendrik. I fear there is. You see? Two weeks ago, a hermit visited us, unannounced, then just as suddenly departed for the top of the mountain. Thank you, Dick, for another cheer. Hello? Whatever for? That I do not know. The moment he heard that Master Pang had passed away, he ran from the temple. He was last seen climbing the path to the summit. Oh, the path. The mountain has become infested with monsters. Emboldened and strengthened by the rise of the Lord of Shadows. It is a perilous place indeed. Sounds like where we're going next. What a lot of fun. This being so, I dispatched a group of disciples to return him to safety. As you can see, things did not go quite as planned. I have trained all my life for a moment such as this, and yet I have failed in my first true test. I have brought shame upon Angrila. Oh no! Might we be able to offer some assistance? I thank you for your kindness, but you are guests here. I cannot ask you to undertake such a dangerous task. A knight of Heliodor does not abandon an innocent in need. These people have shown us great kindness. It is only right that we do them a kindness in return. Would you not agree? That's absolutely wrong, Hendrik. Let's get the fuck out of here. Take advantage of and leave. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. <laughs> but I cannot allow you to bear this burden alone. I shall come with you. Oh, the kid's coming with us? What the hell? We must depart for the summit of Mount Pang Lai without delay. After exiting the temple, we will take the path to the east in order to begin our ascent. I'm assuming he'll be a party guest. Right? He didn't say he officially joined, so there's no way. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go do this with our party guest. Oops. There we go. I guess we'll save before we leave. That's not it. Fuck, I missed it. It was upstairs. Ah, no, we're not saving. Fuck, I'm not going back up. I refuse. Okay. There, music the five. That's the lowest I'm going. Out of the way, chubs. We're headed in here. <clears throat> now maybe I can make the game volume a little bit lo lo louder on stream. All right, here we are. The Summit Tunnel. <clears throat> oh, hello. I already killed the, this dragon, right? Yeah, black dragon. We already killed it in the sewers under Heliodor. So we know we can kill it. And now the power of Pep as well.
It's already yellow. Goodbye. Black Dragon defeating. Our triumph was never in doubt. Easy peasy. I don't need this thing to fly. Bum, 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 bum. Just cheer. He said, "Do do 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 do," and he shows the horn, the music for the for the the song. Brantine cheered. He says, "Want to hear a joke, Scarface?" Ha oh, <laughs> hilarious, hilarious joke. The game, if the game is a joke, the movie is great. The movie Scarface is pretty good, but the fucking game sucks ass. <clears throat> Dick Chudy says, besides Halo, what OG Xbox games that I like? I actually only owned an OG... Oh. I only owned an OG Xbox. Um... To play games like Street Fighter, III, Street Fighter III Strike. I didn't actually own, like, many other games. I had, I had the original Halo 2. And I think that was it. I, don't, I barely had any original Xbox games. So. I got a Sorcerer's Ring. Geek Group Chudy said, Sir Hendrick is too good. Sir Hendrick is quite good. I agree. A flaming horse. I want to see what the hell this thing is. A tantamount. Take that, tantamount. Ow. Backflip. Made that fucker flip. An equable emerald. Oh, nice. Ah, he makes the first joke before the party is time to prepare. How nice. Even though we surprised him, we get to attack first. Great. How nice. Fucking pissed. Take this, bitch. Oh. Double bite. Surprise didn't die. Goodbye. Oh, uh, Dick asked, did I ever get frustrated with the turn-based combat? He's never been able to stand it. No, in fact, I like turn-based combat. This is what I grew up with. So for me, this is like what's expected. Or at least is the norm. So games like this, Blue Dragon, etc., I love. They, I, I don't like the more action-based RPG combat like fucking Minokuni 2, the Tales of series. I actually prefer your turn-based. I always have. <laughs> but that's what I grew up. It's what I grew up with, so I'm used to it. And a lot of people don't like it that much. Continuing on. Uh, why are the mods bullying you? I didn't see that happen, so I don't know what you're talking about. Well, here we are. I wonder what this is gonna be. <clears throat> Holy shit, is he actually up here? That's him? He's fucking Master Roshi. Oh, let's go ahead and save up. See you tomorrow, uh, Metal Gear Rex. Three streams tomorrow, remember. Three. Yusuke says he grew up with Chrono Trigger and he likes both turn-based and action-based RPGs. <clears throat> he grew up cheered and says, I know this isn't for the North Star stream, but how did they even have the tools to lock up Devil's Rebirth in the first place, but they couldn't execute him? It's, it's anime, dude. 
<laughs> the answer to every ridiculous question you have about a ridiculous thing that happens in a ridiculous game like that is it's anime, dude. Alright. What the hell do we have here? Oh, uh, hello? Hmm. It seems we are too late. Is this the hermit we came in search of? Unfortunately so. He was in deep meditation when he breathed his last. I am glad at least that he was prepared to meet his fate. But that posture, it is awful. Uniquely awful. I know it from somewhere. Huh. Oh my god, he was reading Puff Puff magazine. It's terrible. It is awful. All right. Incredible! Issue one of the Ogler's Digest. And in mint condition. Yes. <laughs> wow. <clears throat> ah, indeed. It seems our friend here made his peace with the world before departing. <laughs> this, at least, is some small solace. <clears throat> oh my god. <clears throat> Ah. But this... This is one of the royal treasures of Dundrasil. Why would a lowly hermit have such a... Dick, cheer to ask when I... Could I wreck a bowl to look like these guys? I don't know. I, I, don't, I doubt it, though. My, my head's probably... Bull oh, my the skies! Can it really be? Lord Robert! That's Rob? That's friggin' Rob? Your grandfather was Master Pang's most fervent disciple. Can he have chosen to follow his mentor to the next life, perhaps? So Rob lost all the weight and became a skinny dude. This is him. What the hell? No, he is still breathing. What the fuck, Rob? That's Rob and he's still alive. What? His spirit hovers in the place between life and death. It is only a matter of time before he passes the point of no return. Huh. But there may yet be a way to save him. If you were to follow him into the void, you might be able to bring him back. Oh great, we gotta go between life and death, the but spirit realm. How? Is this even possible? Yes, and surprisingly enough, you'll be able to beat up the creatures in the spirit realm with your swords. <laughs> the ancient teachings tell us that the summit of Mount Pang Lai stands at the crossroads between this world and the next. If you will permit me, I can perform an ancient rite that will send you to the place between worlds. But it is not a decision to be taken lightly. Once that place is entered, there is no guarantee of return. Fuck it, sounds fun. Let's go. <laughs> well, will you take that chance? Will you visit the void and bring Lord Robert back to us? Nah, fuck him. Hmm. Very well. I will prepare for the ritual. Tell me when you are ready, and we will begin. Well, I just saved, so I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's do it. Blech. It is time to depart for the place to which every soul must go, but from which few ever return. It is time to perform the right. What is this foolish dance? What manner of ritual is this? Dick Chute asks, what do I think about The Last Jedi and the direction they take in Star Wars? I thought it was alright, but I agree that there were things in the movie that were totally superfluous and added just to pad the fucking movie. The entire casino planet or whatever was added just to be in there to add extra shit. It literally had nothing to do with anything and was completely worthless. It could have been cut out of the fucking movie, so... It was the movie overall was good, but had a lot of problems. My own, the, my own. Key Group says if Ortegon was actually smart, he would have put fast food chains with highly processed foods all over the world, and it would have had the same results. And been highly profitable. What the fuck is this? Uh. 
<laughs> what the fuck is that? Fuck you, I'll talk to you. I'm out of here. Another wandering soul drifts into my domain. Welcome, child, to the end of your journey. Destiny is cruel indeed to send me one so young. This may be a fruitless question, given the vacant expression you wear, but... Duh! Do you know what fate awaits you here? Yes. He is wise beyond uh. his years. An intellectual giant. I must return to the world above and tell everyone I met such a marvel. Do you think me a fool, boy? Do not pretend. There is no need for pretense here. You are ignorant. This is as it should be. So basically said, I know what I'm doing here, and then she fucking said, no, you know you don't, asshole. Why'd you lie to me? <laughs> Let me unburden you of at least a little of your ignorance. I will explain in simple terms that even an idiot may understand. As you see, this world is a blank slate. It is a place of nothingness. Before Yggdrasil fell, departed souls would come here before returning to the World Tree. But now that the tree is gone, it is a place with an entrance but no exit. Huh. A dead end for the dead. A spiritual cul-de-sac. Well, that's a bitch, isn't it? <laughs> what I'm trying to tell you is that you will never leave this world. Before long, your soul will dissipate and be lost to the void. That sucks. As long as the cycle of souls is interrupted, all who die will suffer the same fate. Until at last, the Lord of Shadows is the only one who remains. Uh, bit, bit cheer. Just cheered. I said, duh, ha, ha. Okay, then. Thanks for the cheer. This is your <laughs> destiny. Whatever that meant. Accept it. For you cannot change it. Oh, yeah? Want to take a bet on that? Or do you cling to the vain hope? That the heart of Yggdrasil may be recovered from Mordigan's clutches. If you do, you are a fool. And yet, you would not be alone in your foolishness. There are others who refuse to accept that all is lost. Some people just don't know when to give up. <laughs> okay then. Sounds very exciting. When bright band brand horses through heaven, I'm not reading that. Enough of that. Open these doors. Open these goddamn doors. Look who it is. Uh. Who refused to die? <laughs> Did you think that he chose death out of a sense of despair? You could not be more wrong. He came here with hope in his heart. The hope that one day he will defeat the Lord of Shadows. Your grandfather came to find me so that I might teach him the last of my secrets. You know who I am, of course. Foolish child. I am Pang, oh. Grandmaster of Angrila. I actually didn't know that. <clears throat> Your grandfather's teacher and tormentor. So she just liked to spank this man, huh? That's what it was. Do you see the She's magic janky. circle that surrounds him? S and M. The precise pattern of movements draws energy from the ether and channels it to create the mandala of Yggdrasil. This is the final secret. He has been flailing away like this ever since he arrived here. It is not good for him at his age. No. But when the great sigil is complete, he will have mastery over a power not seen since the age of heroes. Oh. Oh. Get out of 
night. Don't you dare give up now. Uh -oh. I'll beat your bottom black and blue. I swear it. She's gonna spank him. Oh, oh stick. <sighs> no. Okay then. Yeah, yes. He's gone super Brazilian. Here's Kamehameha. Yeah. Yeah. Well, would you look at that? Perhaps he is not completely useless mm -hmm. after all. Key Group Chino says, man, the game makers really like in uh, inserting subtle sexual suggestions in things. <sighs> yes, they do. <clears throat> oh, oh. <laughs> hey, hey, did you see that? I finally did it. Oh, it was beautiful. Hmm. Yes, very impressive. I thought you had gone soft in your dotage. No <laughs> dotage. But it seems you still have some guts. <clears throat> well done. Shings, Grandmaster Pang, was that praise? Woohoo! <laughs> For the first time in my long life, she's actually paid me a compliment. Oh, that's worn my cockles more than a hundred nips of the hard stuff. Ugh. Perhaps if you could stop congratulating yourself for one moment and squint beyond the end of your bulbous nose, you would see we have a visitor. <laughs> oh my! Is it... is it really you, laddie? Oh, no, you as well. Your poor young life snatched away from you. It's not fair. It's not fair, I tell you. Oh, stop your sniveling. Mm. The boy is alive. He's what? But, but what's he doing here then? He and his friends found your body and sent his soul from the world above to bring you back. Ah, oh, really? But I only came here to... And you went to all that trouble. As you can see, I'm perfectly fine. Finer than ever, in fact. Now that I've learned the final secret, you and me are going to be unstoppable. Come on, let's get back to our bodies and show that Lord of Shadows what we're made of. All right. Stop right there. Uh-oh. Where do you think you are going? I can't thank you enough for all you've done, Grandmaster. But now that my training's finished, I need to be on my way. Hmm. Finished? Oh, but we haven't even begun. Oh, no. Honored Luminary, if you would like to follow me, Time for his spanking. <laughs> Time for get a thorough ass spanking. No dick, I did not get the Trump alert today at all. I don't know why, but I did not get it. Your grandfather has mastered the last secret of Angry La. He now has the power to send enemies straight to the beyond. It is a technique first devised in the Age of Heroes by Morkant. Brother in arms of the Luminary of Legend. For you, I have a technique no less impressive. Ooh, a new technique. An attack of such incredible power that it can tear through all four dimensions. It was devised by Erdwin himself during his training with Ai, our first Grand Master. And it will give you strength beyond reckoning, Luminary. Well, that can't be a bad thing. Me with Morkant's spell and you with Erdwin's attack. We'll be unstoppable. Unstoppable. If All right. How you do I can get master it? it. None since Erdwin has been able to do so. The training you must undergo to acquire this power will be more intense. 
more relentless, more excruciating than any you have faced before. Well, do you think you have what it takes to endure this most trying of trials? Sure. I knew you would make the right choice. <laughs> now, no, I'm quitting the game. Let Delete us my begin. save data. The first step is to focus your mental energies and call forth a blade of pure light. Hold out your hand and try. Don't. As good as can be expected for a first attempt. The heat of battle should help to speed you up a little. Battle? You mean you're going to fight him? Oh, no, the, the poor lad's not ready. Uh-oh. Me? <clears throat> Why would I rumple my nice clean robe when I have you to do my dirty work for me? B what? You're, you're going to make me fight my own grandson? Who better, Lord Robert? You have mastered all our secrets now. There is no one better suited to the task. You're gonna beat the shit out of your and own besides, grandfather. There you go. I've always wanted to see two princes of Dundrasil battling it out. Let me know when you are ready to begin. Of course I'm ready. Why do they keep asking me if I'm fucking ready? I'm here. I'm ready. No, I'm gonna go walk over to the corner and do nothing. There's nothing even in here. Yes, let's fucking go. Before we continue, allow me to give your grandfather an unfair advantage. All in the name of speeding up your training, of course. Mm. Oh. 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 I have milk shooting oh out of my orifices. My. I've not felt this alive oh. in decades! Look at Let all this. Me add a little blighter! All this powdered milk shooting out of every hole. I That's love it. That's the spirit. Don't hold back. Show him the true power of our last and greatest secret. Just you watch me. Luminary, prepare yourself. Beat back the onslaught and unleash the technique if you can. The more okay. you use it, the stronger it will become. You must practice until it is perfect. Here I come, laddie. It's time to show you what this old man can do. All right. Let's beat his ass. What a dick. Quadra Slash? Yeah, there it is. Now it creates doppelgangers. the kill it doubles damage every hit that's it DSP dies game over the game's over last auto save well wow, that's the first time I died holy shit that's actually the last time I died ha <laughs> ha Okay, I actually died. I, I didn't even know you could. I, I wasn't really taking the fight seriously. At all, I wasn't. I wasn't taking the fight seriously. Well, I'm just gonna skip the whole cutscene if I can. Another death? This Come on, skip, skip. Oh, let? Skip. I will, but. Skip! What I'm. Skip! 
as long skip or do you and skip. some <clears throat> skip Okay then. L Dopa just did a 2,000 bit cheer since I'm watching you play while I play. Thank you, L Dopa, for the cheer. Let's yes. go ahead and uh, get you on the leaderboard to the top cheer for tonight. Yeah. <laughs> did you think work. that he chose death out of a sense of despair? All right, can I skip this? He, c you go. Oh, yeah. You know who I am? Yeah, but we gotta do the whole fucking cutscene again. How annoying. The person he has But when the Get up! There's no way to skip this either. I gotta mash through it. Oh, this sucks. This is really annoying. Why the fuck did they make it like that? <laughs> Two hits takes your whole energy bar. Well, uh -oh. <laughs> hey, did you? Hmm. I can't skip it. Oh, my God. Come on! Come on! Oh! Ugh. 